Hey Tori. So for the month of February, I read the book Ellen Foster. It's from the library, that's why it doesn't have a cool title cover or anything. It's raining, by the way, in case you hear that little like ambient noise in the background. So overall, I liked the book. It was basically about this 10-year-old girl um, telling about a couple years in her life where a bunch of these like little tragedies kind of happen. And so she's kind of moved around from house to house. And it's just her telling her perspective of having to live in these different environments. The main thing that I liked about this book was just the voice that I was told in. Because it was very, like, childish, but in a good way. Because it's like, she doesn't see all the bad that's happening in the world to her. She's just taking everything as it is and trying to make the best of it. So as I was reading it, I just picked out some of my favorite quotes. So I thought I'd just read them to try to give you an idea of how she sounded in this book. One day I asked her what they were doing here and where they were from. At first she said Pluto. If I did not know so much about space, I would have said okay and went right about on my business. But I said, you are not from outer space. Where are you really from? By July I called her the witch to myself and all the money she had did not matter anymore. That is something when you consider how greedy I am. I could wake her up and ask have you ever been to the ocean? But I already know the answer. She is not. You can tell. It would humble you, I whisper, to her sleeping, if you for one time stood by something stronger than yourself. And while she sleeps, I think this would be a perfect time for her to die. Before I even met Stella or Jojo or the rest of them, I heard they were the Foster family. Then I moved into the house and met everyone and figured it was okay to make my name like theirs. Something told me I might have to change it legal or at a church, but I was hoping I could slide by the law and folks would think I came by the name natural after a while. So as you can see, a lot of the lines in this book are really dark, but they're told from a child's perspective, so I feel like it kind of just changes it a little bit and makes it funny just to hear it like that. That's what I liked about the book. It just had a lot of really humorous lines, to me at least. I found them really funny. So the plot of this book doesn't matter that much because it's more about how she tells the story than the actual story that's being told, I think. So yeah, I like this book, and it was really short, so it was a pretty quick read for me. So if I had to review this book, I would probably give it about an 8 out of 12. It was good, but I'm not sure if I would reread it. So there's my review for the book. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to be reading in March yet, but I'll figure it out. Alright, see ya.